Welcome to Sid's Tips. Hope you're having a great day. And today, talking about the all new on Cloud Surfer shoe. I think this is like the Cloud Surfer 7 shoe. And they've redesigned this shoe. And I have not owned a pair of on shoes. I did it many years ago, test their shoe, but I was trying to find a shoe that would fit my foot well that has a higher heel drop and that's what this one does. I'm not a runner, um, I can't run because of my back, but I use this uh, for at the gym to walk on the treadmill, so we'll talk about that. A little bit of a love-hate relationship with the shoe, with the width, and I'll talk about that in a minute. I love this color, the black it comes in, also comes in a lighter greener color, an orange, and I think like even a white. Uh, but uh, this color black looks great. And I think it could even be stylish for uh, wearing a jeans as well as being athletic. And by the way, I am also wearing the on running pants, which I like very much. So as far as sizing, I ended up going with a size 12, normally in between an 11 and a half and 12. Uh, this one I found I needed to go up a half a size. And you can see how much room I have there in the toe box. Width wise, this was the challenge. Felt like it was a little bit uh, getting used to with the width wise. So it is a, to me, a wider toe box, even though it's not a wide shoe. Okay, if you're between a 2E and a 4E, it might be a little tight. Um, I just love the look of this design here. And I think this is the best looking of the shoes uh, that they, they currently have. Maybe they'll have some other colors as well. Now I'm gonna go ahead and take off the shoe now they redesigned the sole as you can see and you probably have many of you probably have been reading up about the way they redesigned the sole and what they the the platform that they had taken out of the, the shoe to make it a softer feel and so now that they have added this new cloud tech phase sole and the way it's designed and it really just feels so good and it, you can just really feel as you're stepping on, especially on your heel, how that just, I don't know, it just mushes so soft. It's like a pillow feel and it's its truly amazing. And standing on your feet, I think if you're looking for a comfortable shoe that's not heavy, uh, that is gonna, you're gonna stand on cement. I think these are gonna do really, really well. So you can see there as I'm pushing down on my heel and also even on the the four foot of my shoe, I feel like it's got some nice cushioning as well. So they definitely have done a nice job. Uh, tongue is a little bit of a thicker tongue. I do like it. It's stayed well and uh, no issues there. The tongue is not really tied to the shoe down below inside the shoe. You can see how it's attached to the shoe, um, but not, you know, it's, uh, it doesn't move around, which is good. Uh, you do have some nice cushioning on the back of the shoe there, so which is nice. And also, uh, as far as the tongue, this is, uh, as far as the insole, it's a, uh, you could see a foam insole, nothing overly special other than they've got their design logo on there. Now, if you are looking for insoles, which I have switched to, these are by fit my foot. These are 3D insoles that you can add your own photos to the top. But down here, uh, this is a shell and that matches to your arch. And so you get good arch support. Uh, it's got a soft padding for your heel and also uh, it's not too thick. And these are a great way to give yourself support. I'll put a link and even a discount code to these as well. Uh, so these I just got, and these are Travis, the little dachshund that I take care of often. Uh, and as far as the laces, they don't really stretch, but they seem to hold up well. Uh, and then as far as the sole, there you go. So this feels a little bit softer here versus, uh, this is probably on the front of the shoe and the back of the heel for the road. And it'll be interesting to see how, for runners, how that holds up. Uh, long term, but I think for everyone else when using it on the treadmill I found uh, it was very comfortable to wear uh, and walk in on the treadmill and uh, I do again love 
this design and, and feel. Like if I'm, if I'm pressing on this, it doesn't feel as soft as other types of shoes, but when you step on the shoe, it just feels so good. So on really hit it out of the park with this shoe. I, I, like, I really like the design, and most importantly, they feel good. So check them out, and if you have any questions, let me know, but I thought I would put out my uh, feelings on the shoe from a perspective of somebody who's not a runner, but just wearing them at the gym on the treadmill and just around uh, otherwise. And I also had been testing when I am working from home in my home office with my stand-up desk, and um, I am definitely enjoying them. So let me know if you have any questions, enjoy them, and great job by On Running. Have a great day, we'll see you on the next one.